What's up guys? It's Sydney and this is your 60 minute at home Murph workout. So grab your dumbbells and let's get started. I'm so excited that you're here with me today for this workout. Happy Memorial Day if you're in the United States. It is currently Memorial Day if you're watching the workout on the day that it was posted. We are going to be honoring Lieutenant Michael Murphy today with doing an at-home Murph workout, okay? Before we get started, I want to explain dumbbells. You need dumbbells, and I do have a new little dumbbell rack over here to try and get my dumbbells off the floor. So today I'm using 10s, 15s, 20s, and 30s. The typical Murph workout, if you're unfamiliar with it, there's a CrossFit dedication hero workout that's called the Murph, okay? And typically, if you're doing it in the CrossFit realm or in a box, what the workout is is 100 pull-ups, 200 push-ups, and 300 squats, okay? Obviously, we can't do the pull-ups, so I'm gonna try to modify that to make sure we do the pulling motion, the pushing motion, and the squat motion, okay? Additionally, before the 100, 200, 300, there is a mile run, and then after the 100, 200, 300, there's also a mile run. So what we're gonna do today is an eight minute cardio circuit. So our eight minute mile is gonna start out first. We're gonna modify the 100, 200, 300 reps with 30 seconds, 45 seconds, and 60 seconds reps of back, chest, and squats, okay? And then at the end, we're gonna complete that mile again, our eight minutes of cardio, okay? So just so you know, kind of how I'm modifying this, I wanna place a dedication to this to Lieutenant Michael Murphy and to all the servicemen and women who have sacrificed their life for our country. My brother, I'm not sure if you guys know this or not, but my brother who actually passed away two years ago was also a Marine. He didn't pass in the line of duty, but there was a day that he graduated boot camp and I've never been more proud of him and the sacrifices that he made to become a Marine. So to everyone out there who has a, a family member in service, who's lost a family member in service, to all the men and women that are currently in service, I thank you and this workout is dedicated to you and my brother. All right, so let's go ahead and get started with our warm up. It is a 60 minute workout, so we're gonna rock together the whole entire time. Make sure you've got water and a sweat towel and your weights and we're gonna crush this workout together, okay? You ready? Give me a big thumbs up. All right, let's start with big backwards arm circles, okay? Three, two, one, here we go. Start your breathing now. Great job. And let's cross your arms over your chest, open and close. Perfect, do you have someone that you wanna dedicate this workout to today? Think of them in the times where this workout gets tough, okay? It'll be a long one, so there will be times throughout the workout where you need that extra drive, okay? Think of someone or some friends or family members who you wanna honor today. Single leg butt kicks, let's go. And that'll give you that extra push to know you can do this. Great job. Good, now let's speed that up just a little bit. Stretch those quads out. Let your feet flip backwards, just relax your ankles. Good job, three, two, one. Step it back, let's go high kicks. Okay, six on the right leg and then six on the left leg. And when you get to six, go ahead and switch it over. And also if you know anyone who you think might enjoy this workout, make sure you share it with them either now or when you're done on your social media, Facebook, Instagram, text it to a friend. I think everyone needs a way to kind of dedicate something to someone special today. All right, good. Big wide stance with your feet. Toes are pointed out. We're gonna sink down and up. Just open up those hips first. Good, two more, let's go up and down. Great job, let's rotate that torso left and right. Get the core involved a little bit. So we're gonna start with that eight minute cardio workout, okay, or section of our workout. We've got four exercises to rock through. Okay, and they're all kind of replica running exercises. So it'll be high knees, skips, things like that. Trying to get as close to the actual Murph workout hero wad as I can. Can 
do any pull-ups. I can't necessarily time the reps. Let's go skip jog here, right here. I can't necessarily say, okay, you're gonna get 200 push-ups in the same amount of time as me or the next person. So I'm gonna make timed intervals replicating the push motion, the pull motion, and the squats. Great job. Three, two, one. All right, I want you to pike it down in front. Let's stretch out the back of your legs a little bit. Bend forward here. Walk your hands out into a pike. And let's push your heels down one at a time. Pedal down, stretch out the calves. Good job. Push, push. Good. Walk your hands up right beside your feet or your feet up beside your hands and slowly roll it up. Okay. Let me show you your four cardio exercises. Your first one, forwards, high knees, okay, and then backwards butt kicks. That's your first minute, okay? Second minute is lateral two skips. So one, two, one, two, okay, moving side to side. One knee up at a time, twice, all right? I'll show you the second two when we get there. Let's go ahead and get started, all right? Forward high knees, backward butt kicks for one minute. Let's go. So this is gonna start off our mile run at the beginning of our Murph workout. Good job. If you need to modify any of these movements, just take the jump out, give me a power march on the way down, butt kick push back, okay? Good job, good job. Pushing, pushing, pushing. 20 more seconds here, good job. Perfect. Give me 10 more seconds, and then we'll face back forward and go into those skips. Four, three, two, one. All right, here we go. One, two, switch, one, two. And just keep moving side to side. Keep your arms coming up with the opposite knee. If you're power marching, same thing. Okay, if you need to modify, that's an option. Good, just like you would when you're running. Arms are moving, legs are moving. Good job. 30 more seconds here. We're gonna go two more rounds through those two, okay? And then we're done with them for now. Good. Keep breathing. Perfect. 15, 14. Good, make sure you're pushing yourself. Seven, we're going back to our high knees and butt kicks. Three, two, one, here we go. And butt kicks back. Good. You'll notice my arms are still working just as hard as they were on the other exercise. Perfect, perfect. There we go. Less than 30. You got about 25 seconds, and then we're done with this exercise for now. Push, 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 push. Good job, come on. 13 seconds and we're back to your two skips. Four, three, two, one. Here we go, one, two, two. There you go, you need to modify. March, 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 march. Just move side to side. Making sure you're not crossing your feet. I don't want you to fall. That's it, keep that breath going, okay? Up and up, come on, up and up. Good, 30 more seconds here. 
Pull the knee up right to your hip height. There you go, you got about 15 more seconds. And then I want you to meet me at the back of your mat over here. Good job, we're about four minutes in to our eight minute mile. Five, four, three, come on back right here. Two, one, your next move. Knee to elbow skips. Same thing backwards. Let's go. Modify step march, step march. Okay, just take the jump out. Good work. Come on, you can do this. Thirty seconds left here. Good job. Twenty, nineteen, eighteen. Arms and legs. Let's go. Push. Ten. That's it. You've got six, five. Go ahead and face me in four, three, two. Your last exercise that you have to learn. Four quick feet, one, two, three, four. Hop it over. Okay, go ahead and join me. One, two, three, four. Hop, one, two, three, four. Two, three, four, okay? So you're moving front to back on the first one, and then lateral on the second one. Good work, 30 seconds. And then you're going back to your knee to elbow. That's it, that's it. 15 seconds, come on. Perfect, seven, six. All right, get ready to come on back. Five, three, two, one, here we go, knee to elbow, go, go. Last minute of your eight minute mile, right here. Last two minutes, I'm sorry. This is minute seven and eight. Good, up, and up, and up. Come on. That's it, let's go. Drive, drive, if you're modifying, drive, drive. Same thing, knee to elbow. That's good, 25, 24. Good job, 15, 14, 13. Let's finish this one off. Good, come on, up, up, five seconds. Four, three, four quick feet, hop over. One, two, three, four, let's go. Last minute of your eight minute mile, and then we'll rock into our strength, okay? Work the arms, don't leave your arms hanging here. Okay, work them. That's it. I know, I'm with you. Last 30 seconds here, and we're done with cardio for about 35 minutes, okay? Come on, 20. Push, push, let's go. Twelve, 11, 10, come on, nine, eight. Finish right here, and then we got 30 seconds rest, okay? Four. Three, two, one, and rest. Now's the time. If you need to grab some water, you can do it. Your next three moves are gonna be back, chest, and squats. Okay, the first move, you have a bent over row. Dumbbell bent over row. So pick a weight you wanna use for that for 30 seconds. Okay. All right, 10 more seconds. Bent over rows, and then we've got push-ups. And then we've got goblet squats, and we've got two rounds of those. 30 seconds of bent over rows. Two, one, let's go. All 
Perfect. Ten more seconds, come on. Four, three, two, one. You've got 15 seconds rest. Your next move, 45 seconds of push-ups. Okay, so your hands are nice and wide on the outside of your mat to hit your chest again, okay? We're going in three. If you need to modify, just go right to your knees. Ready? Let's go. 45 seconds. Keep the abs tight, keep the glutes and the quads tight as well. You're over halfway there. 20 seconds, let's go. Ten, nine. Let's go, let's go. Five, four, two, one. 15 seconds rest. And you've got 60 seconds of goblet squats, okay? Just one dumbbell right up here at your chest. Normal stance, okay? One minute in three, two, one. Here we go, guys. Sit it down. Exhale. There we go. 60 seconds here. And make sure you're not trying to hold your dumbbell out away from your chest, okay? Let it sit right against your chest here. Good job. 30 more seconds. Keep your chest and your hips coming up at the same time. Couple more, three, two, one. 15 seconds rest, and you're back to your bent over rows, round two, and then we're moving on, okay? Eight seconds, 30 seconds of bent rows. Are you ready? Here we go. Three, two, one, bent rows, last round. Beautiful job. Ten seconds, come on. Go for it, go for it. Two, one, rest. All right, now we're down 45 seconds of your push ups. Again, if you need to modify, drop to your knees. Start on your toes, see how many you can get in there, okay? Three, two, one. All right, let's get it. Nice wide hands. Come on, I'm with you. I'm trying to breathe, trying to keep my core tight. Come on, we're in it together. 20 seconds. We can do this. Stay on your toes with me for 14. That's it, seven, six, three, two, one, rest. Woo. 15 seconds rest and we've got one minute of goblet squats. You ready? Okay. I really want you to push yourself today, okay? Yeah. Two, one, goblet squats. Ooh. Okay, here we go. Good job. Breathe. Easier said than done, I know. We're halfway there, 30 more seconds, okay?
Tight abs as you sit. Exhale on the way up. 15 seconds. Great job, let's go, let's go. Nine, eight, three, two, one. Rest, and you've got 30 seconds of rest. Woo! Your next move, I'll show you, Woo. is alternating wide rows. So you're gonna hinge forward here, okay, right here, or you can go together, okay? We've got 30 seconds of those, 45 seconds of chest press, and then 60 seconds of a sumo squat, okay? Woo. Three, let's go wide rows, two, one, here we go. 30 seconds right here. Elbows go out and then back. Good job. 15 seconds. Think about the weight that you wanna use for chest press for 45 seconds. Three, two, one, rest. All right, chest press. Grab the dumbbells, lay it on down. Whew. Going in six seconds. Elbows are out to the side. Here we go, two, one, push it up. Here we go. Great job, plant your feet on the ground. Keep your back flat. Elbows go straight out to the side, okay? Good work, 15 more seconds. Whew, let's go. Seven, six, three, two, one, rest. Whew. All right, sumo squat. Okay, so I'm just gonna go one dumbbell here. 60 seconds, your feet are wide. Okay. Big deep breath, three, two, one. Let's go, sit and stand. Make sure your knees don't cave in. Keep your weight on the outer edges of your foot. Keep the knees out. Just a wider stance. Good. Lots of strength here in the middle of the workout. 30 more seconds. And then we're gonna close it out with that mile or eight minutes of cardio, okay? I want you to squeeze your glutes on the way up here. That's it, 10 more seconds. I know this 60 seconds is brutal. Just think of it as two rounds of every exercise, okay? Three, two, one, and rest. Okay, back to our alternating wide rows or together wide rows. Okay, lighter dumbbells here. Palms are facing behind you. <sighs> there we go. 30 seconds, two, one, let's go. And you can bring them together here in the front and then open wide, okay? Squeeze those shoulder blades back. Remember, this is a big pull. Think of what you do for a pull-up, okay? Six, five, three, two, one. Beautiful job. You're done with that exercise. We're going back down for chest press. Round two, if you can bump that weight up, let's do it, okay? Whew. Four, three, two, one. Let's go, 45 seconds here. Good work, let's go, push it out. That breath has to keep going as well, okay? Twenty 
20 seconds. That's it, you've got 10, nine. Come on, push, push, push. I know you can do this. Three, two, one, rest. Whew. All right, just one dumbbell or two lighter ones. Sumo squat, last 60 of your sumo squat. Doing okay? Sweaty everywhere like me? <laughs> Great job. <sighs> Ready? Two, one, sumo, let's go. Wide stance, toes are forward. Keep the knees out. 60 seconds, so it's not, you know, 30 second speed. It's a full minute. Just keep moving. Beautiful job, you've got 30 more seconds. Here we go. And then we'll get a 30 second rest. Now we're on to a new set of exercises. Keep the shoulder blades drawn back and down. So your back isn't rounding. Drop that butt, not your chest. Keep the knees out. 10, nine. Perfect, four, three, two, one. Beautiful job, 30 seconds rest. Whew. All right, we're on to circuit number three. Okay, 30 second back move. You're gonna go supine to neutral grip row. Okay, so you're gonna start here in the front. You're gonna pull side, open. Side, open. So supine means your hands are facing forward. Neutral, I want it facing your ribs. Okay, here we go. Three, two, one, let's go. Kind of like the reverse of what you just did, right? Open, neutral. There you go. 12 more seconds. Six, five, three, two, one. Now you're gonna lay it down, probably the same dumbbell weight. I want you to clamp them together, starting from your chest, close chest press. Okay, 45 seconds here. We're going in four, three, two, one, here we go, chest right over top. Forty-five seconds. I need you to remember to breathe. Okay, thirty more seconds left here. Drive those dumbbells in towards each other as you bring it down and lift. Feel the difference? When you get down towards your chest, you're driving your hands together and then you press up. Good work. 12, 11, seven, six, three, two, one, rest. Now I want you to leave one of those dumbbells down, bring the other one up, and we're gonna go front squat with a pulse. Okay, so one dumbbell here with a pause, I'm sorry, not a pulse. So you're going down, one, two, stand, okay? Two, one, let's go. One, two, and up. Come with me. One, two. One, two. Here you go. One, two. Good job. Two seconds at the bottom. One, two, push, push, push. 30 more seconds, let's go. Good job, 15, 14. Keep breathing with me. I know this isn't easy, but I know we can do it. I know we can. Six, five. Perfect, three, two, one, rest. And we're back to the very top. 30 seconds, supine to neutral row. There you go, big deep breath. 
Remember why we're doing this, okay? When you hit that halfway point, you're like, oh, this is tough. We can do it. We have a bigger purpose today. Two, one, 30 seconds. Let's go. Supine, neutral. Good job. Whew, eight seconds. Come on. 12, or I'm sorry, two, one. Rest, not 12. Okay, come on back down, your closed chest press. I'm gonna bump my weights up. Okay, if you can do the same, let's do it. All right, here we go. Three, two, dumbbells together at your chest. Ready? Let's go. Nice and close, keep them touching. If I turn my dumbbells sideways, see how they're actually physically touching? Keep it that way the whole time. Good job, 13, 12, 11. That's it, come on. Four, three, two, one, rest. All right, front squat with the paws at the bottom. Just one dumbbell. Okay, so pick which ones you wanna use. All right, here we go. Three, two, one, right here, let's go. Pause at the bottom, one, two, and up. Perfect. 15 seconds down. One, two, and push. That's it, 30 seconds down, 30 to go. That's it, that's it, come on. We can do this, 15 more seconds, and we've got a 30 second rest, you're doing great. We are over halfway home, okay? Six, five, four, three, two, one, beautiful job. You've got 30 seconds to rest. Circuit number three is done. Woo! We're on to circuit number four. We're gonna do kneeling rows for your first 30 seconds, okay? So kneeling rows, come on down. All right, we're gonna start here. Row, place it back down, okay? Here we go together in seven seconds. Make sure you have the weight you wanna use. Whew. Let's go in two, one, 30 seconds. Let's drive up, down. Take it back to your hip. Slow on the way down as well. 15. Perfect job. Six, five, four, three, Two, one. Now, leave that dumbbell on the ground. Bring one of them up. I want you to come back to your knees. Place your back hand behind you. We're going chest press, single arm chest press. So you've got this lean right here. Okay, elbow comes down to the side, right in front of your stomach. Press it up, ready? Let's go. And if you need to switch your legs around, you can always go here. But I want that lean back, okay? Good job, good job. Isolating just one side at a time. Round number two, we'll switch over, okay? 10 more seconds. Good, six. Three, good, two, one, and rest. Now, I want you to place your dumbbells on the mat here, side by side. They're touching, side by side. Heels are on top. And I want you to sit down 
right here, then stand, okay? Heels elevated, squat it down. Two, one, ready, let's go. Sit and stand. If you wanna make it tougher, stay right here. Don't come all the way up, okay? Make sure your butt is going backwards too. It's really important to make sure there's not too much pressure on your knees. And I'm trying to show you from the side so you can see my knees come forward a little bit, but it's not here, right? I'm pushing back. Good, reach forward, sit back. Almost there, great job. Good, five, four, three, two, one. Beautiful job, and we're back to kneeling long rows. 15 seconds here, and we're going for our 30 seconds. Whew. Ready? Four, three, two, one. Let's go. Pull and down. Pull down. Come on. Fifteen, fourteen, thirteen. Good job, come on, three, two, one, rest. All right, now, you can go on your knees with that slant back press, or if you want to, you can go back onto your butt. Okay, we're going to the other arm, whatever one you did not just do. Okay, here we go, three, two, one, 45 seconds. If you're modifying, you're going on your butt, make sure you drop down to your elbow, okay? And you're kind of pressing forward diagonal. Good job, good job. 15 seconds. Good job, you're almost there. Six, five, come on. Two, one, rest. Woo, and we're back to those heel elevated squats. Okay. Remember, reach forward, sit back. Okay, heels on top. Here we go. Three, two, one. Reach forward, sit, stand. Keep the knees out again. Don't let your knees cave in. Feel a really good burn in your quads. You're doing it right, okay? That's it, last 30 seconds, right here. Go sit and stand. Come on, drop the hips. 20, 19. Perfect, perfect. You've got 10, nine, eight, four, three, two, one, and rest. 30 seconds rest. Grab some water, towel off if you need to. Whew. Great job. Okay, next move you have, you're gonna do a bent row. Left, right, and then stand. Okay, so you're coming down. One, two, back up. Down, one, two, back up. Okay? Two, one, let's go. I know that rest was quick. One, two, back up, and then do the other arm first. There you go. 10 more seconds. Three, 
three, two, one, rest. Dumbbells out of the way. Okay, we're gonna go shoulder tap, wide stance, half push up. Okay, so come on down, hands are wide. You're gonna go half, tap, tap, half, tap, tap. Okay, so you can do this. Two, one, let's go. Touch, touch, halfway down. You need to modify knees, touch, touch, pulse. Touch, touch, pulse, okay? So with the pulse, I'm aiming for more reps here, okay? Good job, seven seconds. Two, one, rest, and come on up. Woo. We're gonna go one dumbbell right here behind your neck. Seated here on like your traps, your upper shoulder blade. Plie squats, toes are out, going down and up. Ready, let's go, one minute. Good, down and up. Good job. Open toes so you can see from the side. They're open out to the side. Good job, good job. Keep the knees out. Knees out, heels down. Great job. 20 seconds, no need to rush. Just sit low, keep the knees wide, okay? Come on, we're right there. 10, nine, four, three, two, one, rest. Woo! Alternating bent row and stand. I'm gonna bump my weight up for this one. Whew. All right, bump yours up if you can as well. Three, two, hinge it forward, go right and left, and then stand. Down again. There we go. 15 more seconds. Five. Four, one more, three, two, one, rest. Woo! Okay, 45 seconds of your shoulder tap pulse. You need to go to your knees, let's do it. Okay, that's totally fine if you do. Here we go, in three, two, one, let's go. Pulse. Just get that big wide elbow shoot out. Okay, and make physical contact, touch, touch. Fifteen seconds. Come on, seven, six. Three, two, one, rest for 15 seconds. Ah. Okay, plie squat. Dumbbell is on the back of your traps, right here. Okay, sitting right on that meaty part of your traps. Woo, two, one, one minute. Let's go down, toes are out, knees are out. And stand. Come on. That's it. That's it. Let's go. Woo. 30 seconds. And you're done with this circuit. And guys, we've got one more strength circuit. And then finishing up with our eight minute mile. We're right there. 20 seconds.
Keep the heels down. 10, nine, come on. That's it, three, two, one. 30 second rest, you're doing fantastic guys. Woo! All right, 30 seconds rest. Woo. Next exercise, 30 second for your back, for the pull-ups. We're doing alternating high row from the floor. So in seven seconds, you're gonna come down, pick this up using your legs, drive high, down, switch. Okay, ready? Whew. I'll give you an extra 10 seconds, sorry. That's it, last strength circuit, we can do this. Four, three, two, 30 seconds right here, let's go. High, back down, switch, high. Pull, give me a big pull. Fifteen, fourteen. Eight, seven. Pull, three, two, one. Rest. Woo. All right, we're going chest press. Neutral to internal rotation. Whoops. Okay, so come on down here. Hands are facing each other. You're gonna press up, turn pinkies towards each other, and back down. Ready, let's go. Pinkies in, and back down. 45 seconds, right here. pinkies in towards each other. It's gonna activate the top of your chest a little bit more. 15 seconds left. Good, eight, seven, four, three, two, one, rest. All right, squat walks for one minute. I'm gonna throw all this junk out of the way here. So come on back to the back of your mat. Hands are gonna be right here on your hips, okay, or on your chest. Two, one, you're walking outside of your mat, one minute right here. And pushing back, same thing. Keep your hands on your hips if that helps you to make sure they're not lifting or you're not getting here, keep them down. It helps me make sure that my hips aren't rising. You can go here, you can go here, here. Okay, whichever one you wanna do. That's it, you're over halfway home. Come on, go heel toe on the way forward, toe heel on the way back. All right, so heel toe, heel toe. 15 seconds. Come on, stay down. Seven, six, two, one, rest for 15. Guys, last round through those three exercises. Back to your heavy alternating high row. Here we go, four, three, two, let's go, 30 seconds right here. Pull. Keep your abs tight. Use your legs on this one as well. Especially if you're not confident in your lower back. Use those legs. 10 seconds, come on. Three, give me one more. Two, one, rest. Great job. Done with that move. And we're going back to your chest press, neutral to internal rotation. You still with me? All right, let's go, we can do this. Three, two, one, turn it in, and down. Forty-five seconds, right here. Thirty seconds to go. That's 
That's it. Come on, come on. Think of why you're here today. When it gets tough, we can do this. We're in it together. Bigger purpose, right? Come on. Push. You can do it because you can. Four, three, two, one. Rest. Last minute of strength. You've got your squat walk. Remove those dumbbells out of your way. You're done with the dumbbells for today, guys. Unless you want to hold a dumbbell on your squat walk. Okay? Drop that butt down. Three, two, one. Let's go. 60 seconds right here. Every 15 seconds, I'm going to check in and say, lower. Okay? All right, it's about that time. A little lower. Let's go. Down, down, down. Chest up, butt low. And lower. There we go. It's a good check-in. Even if you go back to where you started with the height, just keep dropping it down. Say butt down, butt down, butt down. And lower again. 15 more seconds. Let's go. Low as you can go. Slow and low. There we go, six, come on, five, four, three, two, one, 15 seconds rest, and we're going back to our high knees and butt kicks. We're back to that eight minute mile. All right, are you ready? Let's start back here. High knees forward, butt kicks back, ready? Let's go, hit that last mile. Beautiful, let's go, let's go. One minute here. Good job. This is a point where you just focus on your breath. Your muscles will remember what to do. You just have to breathe. Good job, 20 seconds as of right now. Fifteen, fourteen. Remember what's next? Lateral two skips. Seven, six. Turn back and face me. Three, two, one. One, two, one, two. Move side to side. Good. You're back to that breathing. Remember, modify. March, march. Okay, just take the hop out of it. There we go. Move it, move it. Come on, I'm with you. We're gonna go one more round of each of those after this, and then we're back to our two. Knee to elbow, and then your lateral four steps. Hop over. 15 seconds. You're doing great. We know the next two moves. Forward high knees, backward butt kicks. Big deep breath. Forward high knees in two, one. Here we go. And butt kicks, push it back, push it back. Up, 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 up. Come on, come on. Woo! Thirty seconds. Can you speed it up a little more? Woo. Come on, come on, come on. Okay, fifteen seconds as of right now. Push, push, push. Last 15. Come on, come on. Eight, seven. Get ready for your skips in four, three, two, one. Two skips and over. Come on, last round of this one too. 
That's it, work with me, come on. I know you're here for a reason today. I know you've got someone in mind that you can honor with this workout. That's what it's about today. And up and up, let's go, let's go. 30 seconds, and we're going back to our knee to elbow. Remember that one? Push, push. This is your last mile, okay? You're just about to finish the first half of the mile. 14. If you can work harder, you gotta give me a little bit more. Okay? Here we go, five, four. Remember the next one? Two, one. Knee to elbow, go, go. One minute here. Starting on minute number five of your eight minute mile. There you go, knee to elbow, knee to elbow. Bring that knee all the way up too, okay? Don't just bring it down here. Bring it up. I know that trick. <laughs> I know I do it when I get tired too, that's why I'm saying it. Knee all the way up. Come on. Keep your core in control. Up, up. 15, 14, 13. Come on. 10, 9, let's go. We're about to go four steps and hop over. Four, three, two, right here. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Let's go. You're modifying step. One, two, three, four, step. Okay? Minute number six of your eight minute mile right here. So if you're a runner, kind of think about where this would put you, right? You're about to start on that last 400. Thirty seconds. Come on, come on. Twenty seconds. Go, go, go. 15, 14, and then we're going back to our knee to elbow. And if you've got anything left, turn it up a little more. Three, two, one, knee to elbow. Let's go, up, up. Minute number seven of your eight minute mile. Come on, pour it out. Let's go, up, up. Remember why you're here today. Let's go. Someone's coming to mind right now, right? Do it for them. Let's go, 30 seconds. Go, go, go. 15. That's it. 10, 9, 8. Come on. Four, three, two, one. Four steps and hop. Let's go. One, two, three, four. This is it. Minute number eight of your eight minute mile. We're at it. Woo. This is it. 45 seconds. Turn it up more. Every 15 seconds, I'm gonna tell you to give me a little more. Ready, turn it up again, 30 seconds. Come on. Go, 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 go. 15 seconds, go all out right here. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Come on, eight, seven, let's go, let's go, five. Come on, four, three, two, one, and rest. Whew. 
I want you to grab your water bottle and have a seat for me. Beautiful job. First things first, I want you to lay back, straighten your right leg up, drop your left leg down, pull that leg to your chest. If you can, grab onto your toe. It might be a little tight up in your calf. If you can't, just grab onto your, put, your leg or your calf, pull right to your face. Guys, amazing job today. Thank you for being here with me, honoring Lieutenant Michael Murphy, for myself, honoring my brother, and all the hard work he put in to become a Marine. And for everyone who has a family member who is a service member, any men or women out there who have sacrificed that sacrifice, I appreciate you. This workout was dedicated to you. This sweat came from you in mind. You motivated me today. And all the families that also pay that sacrifice of being a military family. I know that's also not easy. So thank you to everyone. And come on up, straighten your legs out. Thanks for letting me honor those people today. Big deep breath in and out. And make sure you remember throughout the day what the reason for this holiday is and how you can live today and the rest of your days honoring those people that are coming to mind for you. Okay, for me, it's my brother. The word that I keep in mind all the time that he was to me is strong and also loving. He was not afraid to let people know that he loved them so much. Okay, no matter how silly it looked or how much we laughed at him, he was never afraid to let everyone know that he loved them and he was never afraid to show his strength, okay? So as the clock rolls out to zero, come up with me and I just wanna stretch your chest and your back out really quick. But just a reminder, all those people that you were thinking of today or maybe a person that you know that is also thinking of someone, or even if it's just Lieutenant Michael Murphy, if you wanna Google him and look up his story, he was awarded the highest honor in the military honors for the ultimate sacrifice. So whoever you're thinking of today, think of the characteristic that they displayed the most, whether it's strength, whether it's love, whether it's just commitment, dedication, whatever it was, I don't want you to take that characteristic and adopt it into yourself and adopt that into the person that you are. Keep their spirit alive by living in that way, okay? That's what I try to do with my brother on these long workout days, on the days where I'm struggling, where I'm not feeling it. You might think that never happens to a trainer, but trust me, it does. On those days, I pull strength from my brother, and I know if he were here, he would do it. He would crush it, and he would compete with me too. So <laughs> thank you, Zach, for the ultimate sacrifice. Miss you every day. Thank you to everyone who paid the ultimate sacrifice. Thank you to all the families who support those people. And thank you for doing this workout with me. Make sure you share it with a friend and challenge them as well to dedicate this workout to someone that they love. You guys have a great day. Make sure before you head out today, you like the video, subscribe to the channel, and turn on your notifications. And I'll be seeing you in our workout tomorrow. Have a good day.